Hey guys, got level here and Byte is out. Byte is a thing. What is Byte? Byte is a new app created by the former creator of Vine. I'm former creator by the creator of Vine is the guy that created Vine, but then sold it to Twitter. Anyways, it's called, it couldn't be called Vine 2 because Twitter still has the right to the name Vine. So it's called Byte and it's awesome. Okay. I've been following the progress for this for a while now and it's finally out. I'm going to try to make this video and guide you through a couple of things, give you a couple of tips. Maybe I'm trying to do it as fast as I can. Okay. Let's enter the first question. How do you get Byte? You go to Byte.co. Byte is written with a Y, by the way. You'll probably see it in, in the video title. And then from there, try to do it from your mobile phone. You know, don't do it for your PC. And then from there, you can download it either for iOS or Android. Click on it. It will bring you to whatever app store your phone has. And then you'll be able to download and use it. If you want to read the terms of services and all of that, all that information is also on that website, Byte.co. One that is important to read is the guidelines. Like, be respectful or don't be a creep. <laughs> okay, we're going to switch over to my phone. It's an Android phone, but I'm guessing the same things apply for iOS. Um, so you're going to have your app installed. I don't think I need to show you how to install an, all, an app. It's actually going to ask you to um, connect with your Google account. You can either, you know, sign in normally or log in with your Google account. And once you finally created your account, uploaded a profile picture, which you don't have to do, you can click on, I'll do this later. You will land on this homepage. And on this homepage is where the magic happens. Basically, you need to keep in mind that it is very similar to other apps. You will have the major pages will be at the bottom. OK, so you'll have home, of course, research, search, discovery, whatever you want to call it. This is where you will find categories. OK, so if you're interested in a specific category, you can go here and find one. This is very um, similar to how Vine was, but also it's very different from things like TikTok, where you don't necessarily have uh, categories like that. OK, in the middle, this is what you will press if you want to create a Vine you can use you know front camera back camera we'll go back to this a little bit later and then here is where your activity is so this is where all your notifications are basically oh look at all my friends are already following me and then of course last one is going to be profile you can tap it again it brings you all the way to the top and um, you'll see you have this profile thing where you can actually add if you scroll up and you click edit profile you can not only switch your profile picture you can actually choose a color or this whole page and then you can have your display name you can change it whenever you want you can add an about section little description basic stuff so far okay now let's go back to the create section so for the create section obviously you can upload your own stuff so bottom right completely to the right you'll see that little image icon this is where you would go if you already had stuff on your phone that you want to upload again please make sure that everything that you upload goes with the guidelines of of byte okay i need to do that because i i was so excited that i just uploaded a bunch of stuff i'll probably have to delete a couple of them and once you upload it here is where you will uh set you know the timing it's pretty much vine 2.0 so it's only going to be six seconds you're not going to have more than that 6.5 seconds apparently so once you set your six seconds you can press uh, uh that arrow to confirm it and then this will bring you to that page this is the page where it you know uploads it to that byte format and then you can add a caption here. And if you want to tag people, you can use the at, okay? You can add whoever and then tag them in there, all right? Before posting, you would want to put it in a category. So you click add to channel right up top here. And then you have the list of all the channels that you can add it to. Let's go back and then you can click post. It'll post it automatically. You can you also have the option to save it to your gallery, basically save it to your phone before you post it, but we're not gonna be using that. All right, let's go back again and talk about like the video creator. I'm gonna try to put this on my face or something. Okay, so the video creator, if you haven't used Vine before, it's it's kind of particular, right? It's you hold to record, you press and hold to record. You can't just press and then record and then it, no, you have six seconds, you press hold. Okay, so up top here, you're gonna have that purple bar. So when you let go, it stops. And now you can, I don't know, play a different character. This is like a very popular thing. And now you press it again and boom, either you press it until it's over and then it brings you to that page where it's basically done or you can you can obviously record for less than six seconds. If you want to delete whatever you just recorded by increments, at least you can press that little arrow with the X on it at the bottom. OK, so if I press once, it's going to change the color up top as in. Hey, that second part you you recorded, if you want to delete it, press it again. Press it again, it deletes it. If I want to press that 
first part, press it again, deletes it, right? So this is actually a great tool for things like time lapses because you can just press, hold, and then release and then move things around. It's great. Another option that you have is the ghost option. So if I record this and I'm moving and I want to match something, I let go. And then I press the ghost. The, what the ghost mode does, it actually shows you the last frame of your recording. So if you want to match it perfectly, you can go back and continue. Boom, because you have ghost mode. And then once you release, ghost mode is still on, still saving that last frame. Okay. And of course, if you want to switch between the cameras, you have um, that little button bottom left to switch cameras. Right. So this is the, the gist of it. All right. You should you should get it here. They have this experimental category where basically they're trying to come up with kind of a discovery for you, like a for you page, <laughs> but really made um, custom made for things that you genuinely like. They're still working on it. The app is not completely done. Of course, there's going to be updates and stuff. Now, for content creators, I know I make videos mostly for live streamers and content creators. This is just another platform, okay? But something that you need to know is that Vine was never that huge try hard platform. You can try hard and maybe have success with it, but Vine is really, they really value that that authentic, I, I keep saying Vine, but I mean Byte, but it's the same thing pretty much. Uh, it really values that authentic side of things if you watch vine compilations you'll rarely see you know huge production value or whatever it's more instant instantaneous and and really really that wholesome authentic content anyways i don't i don't want to ramble about it too much so it's very very different than tiktok also something that you need to keep in mind is that if you've only seen vine from vine compilation you might feel like comedy is the only thing that is that is popular there it's not true there's like as you can see in the categories there's music there's art there's, there's a category called chill it's it's great <laughs> it's great i'm actually super happy and then there's this idea with the six seconds where people would loop things either music or just or just video and i missed it so much Dom, thank you so much. I can't wait to follow my my all of my favorite Viners and hopefully they come back. But that's it for today, guys. I'm going to stop rambling. I will see you guys next time. Thank you so much for watching. Check me out on Byte or whatever. <laughs> Go out there. Make me proud. Get level out.